The American Legion Riders of Minnesota are going on a ride that will benefit the children of men and women who have since died after the September 11th attacks. Haiti Clotter has a story from Walker. The Walker American Legion Post 134 supports their fallen comrades. Riders from all over the state gathered for the kickoff of a legacy run where donations benefit the American Legion legacy scholarships. College scholarships for children of any military person who's died in military since 9-11 or anybody who's 50 percent or more disabled since 9-11 of 01. For Steve Hootman of the American Legion, it's a no-brainer why they do this. Um, if you can't support a veteran or their families, then it, you're not American. It's very important that we uh, support our veterans and their families as well. 55 students will each receive nearly $20,000. Although their parents are no longer present, the hope is that these children know they're not forgotten. It shows that there are other people out there that still care for them, will care for them, and then it's also kind of a thank you. It's a thank you for those that gave the ultimate. This is the eighth year for the Legacy Run, and about 40 riders will head out tomorrow morning, where they'll make stops in Park Rapids and Detroit Lakes along the way. We'll stop at Fergus Falls at a veteran, Minnesota veteran's home, visit some veterans, and we're going to Long Prairie and uh, ended up in Wilmer tomorrow night. The Walker American Legion had a goal to raise just $15,000. Well, they doubled it with $30,000. In Walker, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. The group will ride again at the, the week of August 4th through the 6th to raise money for the scholarship recipients who come from many different states. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.